I'm Leah and I'm here with my friend Angie and she's about to read my tarot cards and she's going to tell me all about my love life. Hopefully it'll make things a lot clearer. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. How about we start and just see what they want to tell us about your love life okay. in general and then we can ask about specific people. Does that sound good? Yeah. No <laughs> way! No way! Shut up! Shut up! <gasps> so I'm do quickly I'm doing the three card spread and the first card's always the basis of what you're talking about and the first card is the lover's card. So <laughs> they want to tell us about love. They, they answered for us. Oh. <laughs> okay. The biggest picture it says is, well you have love around you and you have lover's choices around you. But right now the cards are like, but you've got a lot going on for you too in your career and yes, you're true. getting your you've been getting yourself ready to let love in and it feels a little bit I mean this could mean you're gonna have a baby with someone <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> but to me it's that um, there's someone that's already around you that it looks like will um, evolve into a m more of a relationship so what they're showing us is that there's someone that you were in maybe you were dating or you there was there was there was a crush there was at least there's someone around you that you haven't given up on but you this is saying you have a you have a when I see this card upside down it's like you've had past lives like you have a really strong connection with him but um, it feels like it wasn't working and right now it's still showing again like it's like you're working on you and he's working on him but he's coming back around um, I just don't know when. He's wanting to focus more on his career stuff right now. Like he, it does, it, the way it shows is like he doesn't really want a relationship, but he's going to come back to you. I don't want a relationship. Okay. Well, that's good then because it's saying the cards want you focused on you. But it, they say that someone's coming back around that's been in your life. How much longer? Why? Well, Why okay, should we ask timing first or do you want to ask about specific people? Which you don't have to tell me their names, but you can just think about okay, them and yeah. I can pull the cards. I'll think about the specific person. Okay, so you're thinking of someone. Mm hmm. <laughs> no way again. It's saying to me, the cards love him, love you guys together. He can't quite give love yet because he's trying to get himself, um, he's working on his career. Like he, there's like things that he wants to get together, but the lovers in the future means like he's not gone from your life. Really? Let's see. <gasps> no. <laughs> the devil card is fun. Really? The devil card can mean maybe too much fun. That makes sense. It can mean that it's fun, but then there's sadness. So that's why it's maybe too much fun. Like it just. It can't go anywhere, or there's some, maybe there's jealousy. All of these things are making sense right now, which is really <laughs> weird. Like, all of it is so in line with my life right now, it's actually crazy. Okay. I think, like I said, he's a good guy, but... It's gonna... I know. think it's some, there's, a, there's someone else you, you're gonna like more. Really? Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> you can keep working on yourself, and love is coming, it's just delayed. That's good. Yeah. Yay. Oh God, do you feel like awesome. you're, do you feel like you're learning? Yeah. Yeah? I like, uh, yeah. Well, I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. I had so much fun. Thank you, Angie. For more episodes, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you all next time.